All my happiness problems are over. I've made Notre Dame. Congratulations. Yay. Hey. It was like two turns. <laughs> that means that's great for you. That's great for you. It sure is. Congrats for doing that. You needed that. Congratulations, Duncan. God, I still don't have my National College. I'm still not at 100 science. Oh, I'm at 126 after my National College. Okay, we need to sort this out. Come on. Come on, lads. Who are like the role who are like good role models today? Do you know what I mean? I feel like even like someone like Neil deGrasse Tyson. LeVar Burton. Who's that who's that guy who did the news article where it's like it's okay to have um a urinal in your home? That guy. <laughs> there is not. I, I can't remember. There was an article when all this whole um tape thing happened where someone was like, We need proper like uh British role models back and it's just like this this dude who's like in his fifties and he writes articles like, you know what? I, I like having urinal in my home. No one else likes it. I don't care what they think. And it's just like, you know what? That's that's powerful energy. That's respectable. That's respectable. That's like yeah. that's masculinity, but you're not forcing it down someone's face. You're just building a urinal in your own home. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> I feel like that's just too much splashback. Splashback, you sell that is is beer. Who else? Who else is like a great positive influence on humanity mm. Mm. Uh, john cena yeah he's a nice lad <laughs> yeah he does the most make a wish love him for that okay john cena sure i think i'll, I'll remove the pope actually whoa <laughs> well you wouldn't remove the pope although this pope's not bad what's his name pope um Paris. <laughs> <laughs> what's the current one called francis francis i want people like um the uncle uh, Uncle Roger, no. Uncle Roger. Um, <laughs> what's his name with the jumper? Uh, Mr. Rogers. There you go. <laughs> Uncle, Uncle Roger. Bob Ross. Yes, okay. You just made the Borbadorber. Borbador. What is that? I, I built it because it gave a garden to my capital city. It gives oh. free, free missionaries. Oh. Did I not? Nope. Did I not do that? No. Nope. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yes, get rid of that. I did the bar Protestantism. <laughs> is brewery new? I think so, yeah. I think it's part of the, like, yeah, it's newish. I haven't seen it before. Mm. Cool. It's quite good. I'm going to be rich. Okay. What do I need? I'm going to improve my religion. What's a merchant slot? Uh, that's like a, a, a specialist slot. Um, so you can get a specialist working. It's where you put the money in. Yep. Uh, all right. I don't think I want that. So there's no other religions in my capital, so that one's not particularly good. What? This can't be true. I can't steal from Spiff. Yeah. It says I can't steal from you because I, you don't have any technology I don't own, but you have a higher literacy than me, so you can't. You must have more technology. Well, what, what's your literacy at? 29. Yours is 31. Yeah, I got no clue then. <laughs> yeah, I think I got the same thing, actually. That's dumb. Is it because I have a spy working in my capital? Of course you do. No, then you have a chance of killing our spies, basically. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah that's a good point. Yeah, I should, I should still. Of course you bloody do. Well, well, she's got a spy. I mean, I would. Okay, I've now got another buff on my holy sites. So my holy sites now, each holy site gives, are you ready? Five food, four Ooh, production. A lot. Five gold, a science. Wow. Um, <laughs> five culture and 14 faith. Jesus Christ. That's insane. Pretty good. It's just a huge number of resources. So I'm getting 100 faith per turn. Uh, are you getting 100 science per turn yet, Lewis? No, I'm not. Um, well, faith is almost as good. I'm at 173 science. I'm going to have to buy this library with money or else it's never. I'm never going to get the science done. I, keep, I put two cities down really stupidly. I did the old thing where you you you, you can build your national college. Yep. So I started building it and then... I did the same. I built, mm. set, settled a city and I was like, oh, I guess I'll just have to wait till I build a library there. It doesn't matter. And then I did it again. Yep. I had me too. I needed more luxuries though. I now have Amber. But I did get a city called Attenborough down after... Ooh, that's a good one. ...the legendary David. Oh, not Richard. Put, maybe, maybe the Queen should have had... To, oh, well, I don't know. In, in memory... What about Jeff Goldblum? He's 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 done a lot. Jeff. <laughs> I could just call one Jeff in in honor of all people who've, who've all, done a good thing. All Jeffs. All G all Jeff. Oh no, then it's Bezos though. Yeah, what mm. about the bad Jeffs? He's not. He's like he's evil. He's, bad he's like Jeff. he's got rid of all good karma created by Jeffs. Oh no. 
Jeff Goldblum. I, I met the guy. I think he's fine. Yeah? Yeah, I think he's fine. He's a lovely weirdo. You, um, I remember watching that interview. Um, it was a Jurassic Park thing, wasn't it, right? Yeah. That was really good times. Yes. That was a good times. Good times. All right, let's automate all these guys, because I can't be fucked anymore to do that. Okay, I can start ending my turns now, I think. Uh, just two more turns till this library's done, and then I can build the great one. What? It's going to boost my science by so much. That's gone. No, the great the li National College one. Oh. Yeah, he just hasn't even done it yet. I need coliseums, I need mo- I Oh my god! I haven't built monuments in any of my cities. No! <laughs> That's no. Oh. What's your culture per turn, then? Zero culture. It says monuments required six. What is your culture per turn? Monument count still required six. You what? What's your culture per turn about monuments? 60. Wow, that's really good. I don't, how the fuck have you done that? Well, because I've got um, these holy sites that give me five oh, culture God. each. I have 65 culture. Why is my culture so garbage? I thought I would have good culture. I've, I've been making... Are you building culture buildings and getting the culture wonders? No, no. Yeah, you've got to build amphitheaters and such. Well, I only just got the tech for amphitheaters. To be fair, Daltos, most of yours is coming from the Huey, right? Because that, that's going to give you, like, nine culture alone. Mm. That was six, but I got culture out the wazoo. Ooh. Okay, I better make my amphitheaters soon, otherwise I'm going to fall behind. God, I've got plus 25% production of food from internal trade routes, but I sent all of my trade routes to city-states to get the... <laughs> <laughs> no, I've done I've done nothing efficient this game. Like, oh my god, if anyone's Brettel, please. Just give me a D in every video. <laughs> I'm, I'm number one now. I'm now number one though, so maybe I am winning. Yeah, winning for sure. He's number one. Uh maybe I'm just lying the whole time, just scamming you all along. I'm I'm clearly the best. Holy shit. I'm I'm number two. Are we all Alex all of a sudden counting the scores? <laughs> Say, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not paying attention, but yeah. But maybe that's because I'm last, lol. Lol. Oh, you got an explorer. Oh, do you want uh, open borders, Doubtsos? Do you want to have a look? Sure. Sure. Since I, I feel like since you bothered to get an explorer, that's like quite... I put the explorer right there just because they wanted to monitor any chicanery on this border. Oh, right, in case. Yeah. In case uh, it starts, a uh, build up starts happening. I don't think I'm going to attack Al Pacino. There's, like, there's a bottle, incredible bottleneck there. I love it. How on earth would I ever fight that city? And he's got a machine gun, so. Al Pacino with a gun. He's got a face full of cocaine and a machine gun. <laughs> Deal for you there, Biff. Ooh. All right, Jeff Goldblum, stop growing. And also, Elvis, you're big enough. 14 is, is too big. Elvis eating the fried peanut butter sandwiches again. Oh no. Oh no. I think that's, I think it's all going wrong again. I'm at zero happiness. <laughs> uh -oh. Not again. <laughs> it's happening again. All right, I just need to catch up in science. Duncan, would you like to resume our trade deal? Already done it. Ah, uh, perfect. I've just discovered theology. Ooh. I can't steal tech from... Spiff. I don't know why none of you can, but it's kind of fun. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't, yeah, it's just not working. I don't know. I don't Good, you greedy bastards. Is it because you put your spy in your own city? I guess. Well, I guess I'll try to steal from Lewis. Uh, I am currently I'm third on tech now. I did all the one cost tech, so I wanted all the trade routes. It's worth doing some of the techs you might think you should, like, um... Is it cartography that gets you an extra trade route? Mm. Oh, my religion enhancer just gave me a free additional trade route. That's so good. That's really, really damn good. Wow. Trade routes feel so much more limited in this game. A religion enhancer? Yeah, you know, when you when you enhance your religion. Talking about. You've already done that ages ago. Yeah, but how come I didn't see the one of those trade routes? Hmm? Well, because it's like, it's plus, it's like plus free faith for international trade routes and plus one trade route. That's it. So for you, that's nothing in comparison to like plus four from all yields on a holy site. Yeah. When you press auto faith purchase, I think it only does one max per turn. Uh, yes. Yeah. That sounds about right. Yeah. Which is very annoying because I set it on like, doing cathedrals thinking it would do it, but it hasn't, it didn't build any. It just built one and then it built one. I was like, what? What? But I had, I had all the faith banked. Have I got a garden yet? Okay, garden. What's that noise? What noise? Oh, it's my city. 
<laughs> There's all these people talking really it's loudly. You. There's a hustle and bustle. <laughs> it sounds like a really like bad like Discord sound. Are you going abroad, Potato? You got to try and colonize new worlds with that conquistador. Yes, I have a few. You, you do have a deal, Potato. By the way, last time you it makes sense for the Irish to go to America. Actually, yes, it does. That's that's our home. Well, our second homeland, our home away from home, yeah. as it is. Oh, sorry, I uh, forgot to answer your deal, Duncan. Hang on. Uh, yeah, yeah, you did. I accept. I think mine Thank and Rillian's deal ran out as well. Yeah, a lot of my deals have run out, so it's uh, I'm, I'm, I'm about hunting them down again. But yeah, I figured, you know, eight cities isn't enough. I don't know. You know, let's go to like 12, 13, maybe 16 if we can get them. That's crazy. You're crazy. I mean, you know. Stop being so crazy. Insane in the membrane. How many can you get? Yeah, like, is it, are you going to be okay? I've got at least three more, and then there's another island I've spotted, so maybe four. I don't know. I don't know. This might be a terrible move. It might be like the worst thing that I could do. But... I think do it. It could also be really cool. How do I win a religious victory? <laughs> Just, is that a thing? Nope. How do I win with religion? Uh, it's it's useless after the um, mm -hmm. midpoint of the game, which is pretty much where we're at. So from here on out, you want to get votes? Can I get all the votes? Uh, yes, world religion, I guess. In order to get the votes, you need to win over the city states, but you can't win them over with religion alone. You can use religion to get yourself enough gold to do that, I guess. I've not done a great job on the old city states, I'm afraid. Well, the thing is, you've used the religion to get your boosted yields, and if you catch up with all of the yields and techs you missed, you should plateau out ahead of us, basically, is is the goal. And you can use your excess faith to eventually buy a whole bunch of units, which is good. Right. Well, again, I didn't take that tech, though, to build the, buy the units one. Well, you should be able to buy, um, after finishing, what is it, P uh, piety, you should be able to buy certain great people with faith. Yeah, great. You can faith purchase great people of every kind, with the exception of a great scientist. Oh right. Oh no, you're allowed to buy one great person of every kind. Yes. Yeah. So that's quite useful. Maybe I should queue that up. And then commerce, exploration, and uh, yeah, commerce, exploration, and aesthetics will let you great uh, person faith buy um, as well. Once you get into the industrial age, I think. Adopting all policies in the biology causes a great profit to appear. Holy sites, blah, blah, blah. Provide a free garden in your first four cities and allows faith purchase of one great person of every kind with exception to a great scientist. But it hasn't let me do that. Maybe I accident. When does that appear? Is that later? I think it, it will be the industrial era is when it allows you to do it because that's when you're normally allowed to faith buy people is the industrial era. Okay, no, that makes sense. I'll wait patiently. Good, good. You patient, patient man. Sistine Chapel. Mm -hmm. No, my scout died. Blessed Island Scouter. Rip. What a guy. How did it die? Uh, there's like four bajillion barbs everywhere. <laughs> oh no. We all hate the barbs. How do I get? Where do I get work boats? Why can't I? How do I improve fish? Oh, workers. Workers. Just workers. Oh, they, there's no work boats anymore. Nope. Right. That's actually so much nicer. Yeah. Thank goodness for that. That's, that's what deal is this? Sure. Sounds like a good one. Yummy. I give you wine, you'll give me gold. You have wine. I have gold. Let's marry our daughters. Oh. <laughs> Lovely. To son. No, no, no. It was progressive back then, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> My daughter will marry your daughter. Together they'll... And we shall produce no heirs. <laughs> yeah. They can adopt. That's okay today, I think. They should be doing, you know, arranged marriages. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you know what? I've been saying it all this time. Arranged marriages. <laughs> Let's just do it. Marry our daughters together. <laughs> I mean, why not? Why not? Now nah, we're doing it. We're at turn 81. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, we're not really doing we're it. We're doing it. It's fine. Terracotta army. Yeah. Finally, yeah. someone built it. <laughs> I uh, I wanted to get it out of the way uh, because that saves me from building uh, troops. Don't worry. This is purely defensive. Mm-hmm. It's a defensive terracotta yeah. army. No, that's fine. Well, it doesn't, it doesn't do anything anyway. Just gave me a bunch of dudes. I debated on whether or not to build it, but then I realized I have like two units, so I decided against it. <laughs> Good choice. Yeah, not that useful for you then, Potato. Stop converting my cities! He's just <laughs> doing it passively, right? It's just happening. <laughs> or is this Datus? No, he's using a great profit. Actively. <laughs> very actively. <laughs> You're using a great profit? What? I don't Why know. Why use a great profit for that? Because my, my holy sites only give plus six faith. Why would I ever just plop them down? Six is like... 
quite a lot. And do a holy site build. True, true. The holy site build is, well, I don't know if it's legit, but it's fun. Says the man wondering what to spend his faith on. Well, I'm going to have to spend 670 to get a great, another great profit. I just, I'm just going to have to spend ludicrous amounts of faith on great profits. But that's okay. That's what, that's what I'm expecting. So let's have a look at all your religions. So, Voronism. Yes. Don't even know what that is. It's named after a religion in a Brandon Sanderson book. Yeah. Oh, of course. Isn't it like a kink when you want to get eaten? <laughs> uh, yeah, that is it. That would be Vor. You got the panthe- the good pantheon, then you just... You haven't even upgraded it, though, Potato. It's disappointing. Well, I don't make that much faith, because I'm only now building my temples. Right. Yeah. I've gone Protestantism. I live fully into this holy site. Uh, holy site. I've got both the ones that give you bonuses from holy sites. That's my thing. I think it's working all right. Foodism is um, not a lot of food I'm seeing in foodism. There's only f- it's- well, it's because by the time I got my religion, you guys took all of the fucking good food ones. There's a food building which is like plus fifteen percent pop retention. It's like an additional aqueduct, and some bastard took it. Mm. Yes, it's the um, bastards. So the, I think it's the pagodas. If I had that, my capital IQ would not easily be up to 30 pop by now. Instead, it's a measly 26. Uh, that's disgusting. We all have religion, though. Bad Moon Rising. See, I put a, I put a, I put not a mod. I put an option in that everyone gets a religion. So I thought it was fun. <gasps> what fucker made the L ting? I did because I have an island in on Tundra. Me too. Yeah, but I set up mine oh, like no. twenty turns. I've been building it for like twenty I've turns. I've also been building it for twenty <laughs> turns. <laughs> Shit. But yeah, I started building it like last turn because it was going to be like nine turns. Like, yeah, I can build it there, I guess. But been yeah. building it for years. <laughs> Same. <laughs> oh well. Where's Deltos? There you are, Deltos. Would you like to resume our trade deal, Deltos? I already sent it. Perfect. Got to tell you, I've built it, and uh, it's not really improved much. The garbage tiles are still <laughs> pretty garbage. Uh, they just give an extra culture now, and that is it. Yeah, I like that, though. I wanted all that. I, I'm low on culture. I needed it. Well, how about I send you money? <laughs> sure. What's the deal with, like, sending food and production around late game? Like... Maybe I should be sending it to my like edge cities to build to rush buildings out more than what I'm doing, which is just mindlessly sending food to the capital. I don't know if sending food to the capital is really helping me right now, or ever. Hmm. Well, it's a good way to grow your capital. It is, you know. Especially if it's like mine, it's shit. Got no fucking food. It's making a lot of wine, like gold from wine, though. It's making a shit lot of wine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting, I'm getting a lot of money from gold from, from wine. <laughs> Why aren't we building anything? We're too drunk all of the time. <laughs> We're just too fat. I think it's very appropriate. But you'd think the population would, would skyrocket if all that wine. We've based our entire culture on drinking. We're the British. <laughs> too real. <laughs> yeah. Too real. We also have we also have tea. So yeah, very. You just love liquids going in. You've got a lot of wine, and then you've got tea for the to the morning after. Oh god, I almost rushed bought a workshop having already got a workshop there. Ooh, that would have been bad. Wait, you can't even do that, surely? How have I still not met Lewis? Honestly. I am actually surprised. He is literally just to the left of Hong Kong. I haven't done any exploring, to be fair. Hong Kong? <laughs> oh my god, guys. Lewis, if you want to win like a tourism victory, you need to explore a bunch. If you want to win a city-state victory, you need to explore a bunch. I know, I need to meet all the other city-states. How many are there? There are a bajillion. Yeah, I know. I've <laughs> met like four. <laughs> oh, no. Stop, end it. Stop automating workers. End your turns. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had like four workers to automate. I'm sorry. If you're going to automate worker, you have to end your turn. Goodness sakes. You guys are out of control. For goodness sake. What do I want? Do I want to build an explorer? Okay, fine. I'll build an explorer and he'll go scouting. Okay. Happy? Yes. Yes. I'll get out there. But I don't have a coastal city, so I can't really get a boat around the coast. Sounds like a you problem. I guess I could make one, but then, you know, you know what it's like doing that. Oh, yeah. It's a slippery slope. You start slipping, <laughs> fall down the slope. <laughs> <laughs> I want another... Eh. Let's get another scout. Let's do some exploring then. So I can find Lewis. A wise decision. Only 80 bucks for a scout. Okay, right. Let's check in on demographics. So, highest population, 
is me. Lowest population is Potato. Big Popo. So I have 14 million people. Potato is 2.6 million. Damn. Uh, crop Ooh. yield, 192 highest, which is me. Uh, but it's it's quite close to the average, so everyone's pretty close for crop yield. Manufactured goods, which is what? Total production. Highest for that is Fidel Castro. Yay. Lowest. Oh my god, I haven't built this thing yet. I haven't built my unique grand temple what? yet. Lewis, oh, no! no. That gives me... <laughs> oh my oh, god. No. Oh, I forgot I had this. Oh my god. You kind of suck at this. Oh my god, <laughs> Lewis, that one is so good. I, need to, I think I'm just getting old, like, guys. I should write, I should have written myself for something. I got like a list, yeah. Oh, what a disaster. Oh my god. Sorry, where were you, Spiff? Go on. Oh my, I don't even know if I want to continue, but okay, fine. So most production and most gold uh, production is Duncan. He's quite far out on both, actually, which is good. Lowest on that is Riffian. Uh, most land is, of course, Potato. Lowest is Riffian, uh, mm. which I'm surprised isn't me, actually. Mm. Uh, soldiers, highest, Riffian. Uh, lowest, me. Approval, highest, me. Lowest, Daltos, I think, yep. And then literacy, highest, me. But the average is right behind, so everyone is at the top for science except for Daltos, basically. Nice. Yeah, I've skyrocketed quite a bit because uh, I got national college on like universities everywhere, so it's been helpful. Mm. I made the Alhambra uh, boost city culture output by twenty percent, which is pretty good. So now I have a bit more culture. Duncan, do you want open borders so you can go see Lewis? Uh, yes. Yeah, I, I just sent my scouts on auto explore, so I assume it will happen at some point. Well, I'll just open it up so that there's a more direct line. If you literally go left from where your scout is, you'll hit him. Okay. Stop! Oh my god, I, my city, I lost my religion. No, <laughs> dear. That pretty good. You took your eye off that religion for one second. I just a great prophet Whoop. just popped in and just took it onto my holy city. <laughs> oh, that's bad news. So what's the second happiness building? I have my circuses. Colosseum. Colosseum, yeah. And wait, what's after Colosseum then? Uh, zoos? Uh, there isn't one. Oh yeah, zoos, I guess. I haven't got zoos yet. I think zoos, yeah. Where the hell are they? They're quite deep, if I remember correctly. They're like, um... Ooh, right. Time to go through every city and tell it to stop growing, because I've just hit zero happiness. Uh-oh. Yeah, me too. That's what I've done. I've put all of my other cities on stop. Mm. Uh, there's also stadiums along the top of the tech tree um, over at uh, Refrigeration have happiness and zoos I've got no fucking clue I can't find them <laughs> zoos are I, I got them they're at the bottom somewhere I think it's printing press oh yep that sounds about right Yes, yes it is. Printing, printing. I sent you an open borders offer, Potato. Ah, oh, printing press. This is going to save me. Perfect. Uh, this is where my unique building is, actually. The uh, Irish pub. Oh. As soon as we learn to write, we learn to drink. And oh, wow. offer. <laughs> well, you need a printing press to print the labels. So. Oh, for the beer, it makes sense. Why don't you just write them with a pen? It's, it's a lot of work. You need to learn how to write for that. Don't Too drunk for that. It's a lot of manual labor, you know? Right. We've got to automate our drinking. You don't need labels when you got taps, though. You just use barrels and taps. You know, you're making far too much sense right now. <laughs> I, I, I feel threatened by it. Just drink some, <laughs> drink some more of my wine. <laughs> nice to hear the turn ticking over and then someone builds a wonder. Leading Tower of Pizza. 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 That one is the great person generator, right? Yes. Cute. Oh, God. So I need one market, one workshop, two monuments... It's five barracks, two coliseums, and four universities, and one temple. Ah! Nah. I need to. I need to do this better. Um. Okay, let's 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 focus on getting my unique temple done, my unique grand temple, because that boosts my science by twenty five percent, which would have been so nice to have. That would have been pretty nice, yeah. About a thousand turns ago. All right, fine. Oh man, that feel when you uh, click one social policy and see your uh, gold per turn shoot up which is like double no. nice. oh my god very nice i don't i don't have that feel that's a good feel i wish there was a button that i could press that told my entire empire to stop growing instead of having to go to each city and be like you know you you can grow you can't grow it's nice because you can you can sort of can like tell them cease no one will have babies for this turn 
What, just like have like a one child policy? I just want to be able to put out a decree. It's like no more babies for the next like 10 years and we'll, we'll have them later. Give up, give up, have a baby break. I want to have a baby break. Sounds like a really crap chocolate bar. Like a, like a Kit Kat or something. Have a break. Have a baby break. <laughs> no. <laughs> Doug, you built three scouts and they're all just coming in a wave. <laughs> yes, I found you though. <laughs> it's happened. <laughs> it worked. Can I see you on the list now then? I can do an incense for wine deal. Would you like some wine? <laughs> just a wave of scouts. Hello. Where are you come to? My yeah, me too. I also came to my me as well. <laughs> I got wine. He was a wine. <laughs> right, I should. Head, I should probably work towards getting universities at some point. Well, I mean, it's up to you, isn't it? What's the move with great writers? Do you make great works or do you pop them for the culture right away? Great works, right? I do great works. It yeah. honestly depends. I usually go for the culture boost, actually, because the culture boost. What about the tourism? I don't care about the tourism. Tourism is tourism is redundant unless you're going for a tourism victory, whereas the culture boost True. does matter quite that a lot. It stops the tourism victory. Yeah, it slows the tourism victory. It protects you from the tourism. Mm. The real thing about like getting that initial culture thing, right, is that like bam, that gives you a social policy now. And having that social policy now will help you for the rest of the game. Versus building great work now gives you gradually yeah. better culture per turn, which might end up being more in the long run, but the the benefit long term could be valued out by the True. fact that you get a social policy yes. earlier. Yes, okay. So. I shall explode my great writer for culture right now. Culture now versus culture later. I want culture now. Yeah. Have you guys already built Notre Dame, the Alhambra? Yeah. Oh no. A few of those have gone. Oh, how do you? I haven't even got close to these texts yet. Oh, this isn't ideal. This guy doesn't even know what Notre Dame is. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pants him. <laughs> <laughs>